Oops, started it too soon. Hello, friends. Do you want to see my nails? I just did them last night. I do my own nails with um, shellac or whatever you call it. Gel. <laughs> okay. Let's do pick a stone, any stone. These are just really random stones. Hey. <laughs> Take your pick. Um, this one is more... <laughs> Tourmaline. <laughs> this one's amethyst. Which one did you choose? If you chose this one, this reading is for you. And if you chose this one, that's okay. Cause I'm still going to do that reading in this video. Okay. So if you chose this one, this one's going to be for you. And if you would like to donate to, for, um, any of the children in Uganda who need food, soap, uh, mattresses, whatever they can get their hands on, um, stuff to eat, uh, you can go to the link below and click if you would like to donate. A dollar helps, but I love you guys. Here we go. Okay, so if you chose the amethyst, your angels are saying, do something different. Do something that you would not normally do. Start doing that. And it's actually going to take you into a new direction because I'm actually seeing somebody going to like Chili's or something, right? Sitting there and every time they go, always ordering the same thing over and over and over again. And sometimes we're creatures of habit and we like what we like and we don't want to divert ourselves from it. And that keeps us on the same path. But if you make a new decision, this is going to bring you a new outcome. And this new outcome is going to bring some kind of a chance situation that would not have happened if you didn't make this different decision so like if you keep making different decisions from like doing it from a smaller area like changing your food um changing the places that you go changing the times that you go to the gym whatever this is something's about to happen okay you're gonna have an epiphany that takes place and be like holy shit this is like a breakthrough i've been wondering why things haven't been working out with for me but they just haven't been in alignment with the other person just yet because I'm seeing somebody being bit by the love bug. So when you put yourself in new positions, you're going to put yourself in a new situation with somebody that you wouldn't have been before. It's like whoever this person is, they're softly approaching. You know how sometimes like there's a bug on you and you can't even feel it and you're like, I know something's here. I know something's coming. I can feel it that's legit what this energy is it's softly approaching okay oh my god and whoever this person is they are very loving they're showing parenthood but this doesn't actually mean necessarily that they're a parent it just could mean that they're very very cuddly very kind and loving and understanding and they really do like to listen this person is charming with their words okay and there's fire sign energy as being significant. So that's Sagittarius, Aries, or Leo. Your angels are saying, if you make these changes from now up until the summertime, the summertime is when a massive change is going to happen. That's when this energy is gonna feel bit by the love bug. Oh. Yeah, your angels are showing a very, very special time, okay? This is gonna be, it says one for the books, for taking chances, a really memorable time in your life, okay? And you might even feel really sensitive during this time. I'm seeing a lot of reminiscing on the past and comparing it to the present. But your angels are saying the past was a mess, so thank you next to that because it kept you weak and that's not who you are, okay? There's earth sign energy here as being significant. So that's Capricorn, Virgo, or Taurus. Angels are saying, see this, the God spells, Gospels. It, the card says the most powerful magician in the cosmos watching over you, right? But what I'm seeing is like, it's just your higher self guiding you to make a new decision. Hey, girly. Confirmation. Confirmation. All right, all right, all right. Now we'll move on to the next one, to the tourmaline. 
All right, all right. I know it's your friend. I know. But you're not supposed to yell. So if you chose the tourmaline, hey Rue, that's enough. <coughs> Sweetie, she's biting your tail. No. <coughs> Are you done? Are we good? You okay? Love you. All right. If you choose the tourmaline, this rating's for you. Oh, oh, okay. I see that financially, you are about to be paid your worth. You're gonna have some kind of a financial gain that's going to make you be able to give money out to other people around you. So I definitely see you sharing the wealth. Um, your angels are saying, it's finally gonna feel calm after a lot of difficulties, okay? You've still stuck out or like continued to be optimistic throughout all of the negative things financially that have happened. And your angels want to assure you and let you know, look at all this money around you and you got the star card, okay? With your consistent effort, this is leading you to good income, to financial security. And you're actually somebody that truthfully is meant to live in luxury and have that financial uh, stability that you've been wanting for quite some time because I'm actually seeing a lot of worrying a lot of anxiety also like worrying and anxiety about other people copying you people in the workspace not being as uh, business like as you'd hope they're just being more weird and petty whatever this energy is um, it causes a lot of anxiety a lot of feelings of being overwhelmed but your angels want you to know that you don't have to stay stuck in a situation that makes you feel bored or it makes you feel emotionally empty um, because you don't want to hold yourself back from an opportunity. You could actually miss an opportunity for not taking that leap of faith. And if there is worrying and anxiety surrounding finances and where you are, it's important to kind of like the first reading, make a different decision than what there has been making. Because if you are able to do that, you are going to be manifesting different choices, different surprises for yourself. Wow. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Continue manifesting, continue fantasizing, continue being proud of the accomplishments that you have achieved up until this far and the more honor you give yourself for that the, and it's not like being smug type energy it's just literal honor for yourself because a lot of other people don't tend to to do that or tend to praise you the way that you deserve um but they will start to praise you when they can get a piece of the pie mm. 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 but your angels are saying when you do start to get a good amount of money it's important that you get a lawyer though because there's something that you're not going to be able to see yet that's going to cause a difficult choice in your life financially surrounding somebody that you do love angels want you to continue to have faith continue to have courage and be strong throughout this situation but if at any point you have to hold up your boundaries you will have a cushion to fall back on you'll be fine um, but I'm not so sure that this individual and the relationship will be fine wow because they're showing an emotional separation from whoever this person is that tries to test you or bring you a disappointment when you are on your way up um, Hmm. yeah whoever this person is they are showing tension they are showing a betrayal somebody oh my gosh you have a lot of competition around you and it kind of makes me feel bad for you but at the same time this is something that fuels you so I don't have to feel bad for you I can just say that I see you for all the work that you've put in and I've seen 
all of the struggles and the uncomfortable energy that you are feeling right now up until this far but i also see what is about to come in for you and all of the the reasons as to why you were so driven in the past it's because your future self was kind of looking back and saying keep going keep going keep going because the success we are about to experience it's going to give you the goals that you've been wanting for so long so it's like if you are patient and you continue to be that driven person that you are and that energetic person that you are and even though there are people around you that will want to take 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 from you it's like you still have that positive mindset that's what's going to keep you at a higher vibration and keeping yourself at a higher vibration is going to bring more more success more money more luxury um, but at the same time sometimes it also brings some problems with it and that has to do with those people who are going to be a little bit sticky fingers you know what I mean so just be aware um, use your intuition and don't forget some of the things that happened in the past like you can forgive but don't forget always remember the way people treated you um, because if you don't, there will constantly be more reminders in the future that will bring repeated cycles over and over again that you won't want to experience. So boundaries are necessary and dealing it within the present moment is necessary because if not, if there's just brushing it away for now in the future, it will keep coming back over and over again. Whew. But yeah, we're going to end this on a good note and say that you are going to be able to share that wealth. You are going to be able to have all the money that you desire, but be discerning about who you share it with. Um, cause it doesn't mean that you're not going to have enough to share it with them, but are you going to want this person in your life just because they are money hungry? Like, or like an opportunist type energy. So just be careful of that, that's all. Yeah, if you would like to book a reading with me or purchase one of my tarot decks, you can go to my website, chelseamgomez.com. And that seems like the end because Ruru's growling and the other dog's barking, so. I love you guys. If you would like to donate um, for the puppies or if you would like to donate for the families in Uganda, you can go to the links below. Ah, shh. You guys already helped save Catherine. She's going to be getting her surgery soon. So thank you so much. I love you. I love you. I love you. I love you. Thank you for being an earth warrior with me. And Ruru too. Love you guys.